Welcome back, everybody, to another episode of Vintage and Collectible Stuff. It is December Jam Pack time. Here's my December issue of old school Jam Pack baseball cards. So let's just take a look, open it up. There is the mystery pack right there. Right here, we'll leave this to the very end, of course, as you do. And we've got some 1989 Bowman, some Top Stadium Club, some 1990s score, it looks like. Uh, that might be 1988 tops. Another score, some puzzle and cards from studio. Uh, upper deck, upper deck, and upper deck. We have 1987 Fleer. We have 1992 tops baseball. 1990 Bowman. 1991 Bowman. 1987 tops. We've got, is this 88 Dunruss, I believe? And we've got 1988 Fleer, 87 Dunruss. A few more to go. Another Dunruss pack, and another Leaf, and Fleer Ultra. We've got, in addition, we've got our 12 cards. We've got our top loaders, and our penny, penny sleeves. So, this is take everything away. So just get in the way, clean up a little bit, and let's take a look at these packs that we've got here. Oh, first of all, why don't we just do this first? Yeah, let's do this. We've got Randy Johnson on the back, and we've got Rod Carew to start us off. Looks like, uh, what year is this? 1984 Fleer, Rod Carew. We've got Triple A's, Canseco, Steinbeck, and McGuire. We have a Hall of Fame Heroes Dunris. It's Ralph Kinnar. This is from 1983. We've got a Paul Molitor from Upper Deck Collectors. Joe Morgan, Hall of Famer. Cal Ripken. We've got Tom Seaver in the house. John Smoltz. Don Mattingly. A Curry Pocket. Jim Palmer and our Randy Johnson. Haven't seen this car before from Fleer 96. So there's our singles from the Legends pack. Put that over to the side. And let's start out with, let's go with Fleer 1991 Ultra Baseball. Now these are all going to be baseball cards. Of course, it's all that I collect. And we got Hall of Famer on the back already. Let's take a look, flip it over. We've got the, oh, wonderful, awesome, the Expos sticker. Love the old Expos. We've got Rick Honeycutt, Eric Plunk, Glavin, Lee Stevens, Kirk Stillwell, Checklist, another Hall of Famer, Craig Biggio, Bobby Thigpen, Ron Gant, Carlos Baerga, Mitch Williams, Cal Ripken Jr., Hal Morris, and Wade Boggs. So, we got ourselves three Hall of Famers in the first pack. That's a good start. Let's start now with uh, the Leaf. Is this 1991 Series 2? Think of this as a, a late Christmas present to myself. I bought this a few weeks ago. Let's take the puzzle away. Let's turn over to the Bip Roberts. And looking for Hall of Famers and rookies. Mike Flanagan is not a Hall of Famer. Charlie Huff is not a Hall of Famer. There's Greg Jeffries. Would have been a nice card to get back in the day. Tom Hankey. Pat Tabler. Neon Dion Sanders. That's a nice card. And Alvin Davis. So nothing there to write home about. Let's go now to this Dunruss pack. And we've got, what year is it? Trying to have a look on the back. Looks to be 89, but it could be 88. And it will be, in fact, a 1990. All right, the red ones. Yes, Chuck Finley here, Bobby Witt, Ray Siraj. There's a lot of error cards in this pack. There's Fred McGriff, Hall of Famer. Put him to the side over there. A lot of error cards, but I'm not chasing error cards, especially these late 80s, early 90s packs. Lesser obvious error ones, like really 
well-known common error cards. Let's try the 1988 Fleer. Might get ourselves a, what, a Tom Glavin, I think, in this pack. Maybe Roberto Alomar's in this too. There's the Astros sticker. Mitch Moreland. Uh, John Perlman. Don't remember him at all. Willie Hernandez. Benito Santiago. Dwayne Murphy. Vance Law. And looks like we're striking out there. No one there worth keeping. Let's go to the next Donruss pack. Will this be the 89? Let's take a look. It is the 89 version. So this might have Ken Griffey Jr. in it. That would be sweet. That'd be a nice pull. We've got here a couple Braves, a couple Blue Jays, Doyle Alexander, Andy Van Slyke, and nothing. All right, the last two packs haven't been very kind to me. Let's go with um, 91 Studio, shall we? Let's try and hit up the very late 80s and 90s. See if I can rip this open. You think this would be easy for me nowadays? That's what you need a knife for. We got a puzzle card there of, I think, Rod Carew or Harmon Killebrew. We've got Franklin Stubbs, Tony Pena, Brian Harper, Wally Joyner, and Hall of Famer is going to be no one. That's three packs in a row. What is happening? Let's try the 1991 score, Series 1. These packs are always easy to open up. And let's check out and see what we have. I think I might have lost my mojo here with these packs. Commons, Commons. Eric Davis, Dan Gladden. Okay, four straight packs. Let's go with the other 90 score. This might be series two, not too sure. And I'm gonna start out with Kirk Stillwell. There's Joe Carter with the Indians. And Alvin Davis again. John Smoltz, there's a Hall of Famer. Put him in the Hall of Fame pile. Jose Canseco. All right, so we've broken the streak there. We're back on the right road. Now we're tearing into Stadium Club 1992, Series 1. Should be 15 cards in here. Hopefully they're not stuck together. And let's see. Are they bricked up? They are bricked up a little bit. There's Paul Molitor, Milwaukee Brewers. Albert Bell. We've got ourselves here a membership card. Tommy Green. Matt Noakes with the Yankees. Pete O'Brien. These aren't so bad. They're, they're not stuck together like I feared they were or would be. We've got here Dave Hollins. We've got Kansas City Royal. A New York Met. Anthony Young. He was supposed to be the next great thing for the Mets, but didn't turn out to be less like that. Uh, Roberto Alomar. Pegs. And Greg Cattery. All right, let's switch over to some Tops baseball. We got here a big pack opening up 1989. So let's go with Dave Rogetti, Glenn Wilson, Mike Flanagan again, Fernando Valenzuela, a couple manager cards. There goes the gum. There's the propaganda piece. There's another Alomar with the Padres. Put that over there. Jesse Orozco, Corey Snyder. 
Another Rick Honeycutt. Damon Berryhill, All-Star Rookie Cup. Brady Anderson, that might be a rookie card actually for Brady Anderson. Don Zimmer and Checklist. So that looks like a, pretty much like a bust for the most part. Let's open up 1991 Bowman. There's supposed to be a stack of rookie cards in here. Maybe a Frank Thomas. Uh, if I can get it open. Whoa! Almost flew across the room. Nope, there's Chipper Jones. What do you know? Rookie card, Chipper Jones. Let's put that on the stand in the back there. That's a keeper. Let's put them back together. See if I can pull any more. Dave Parker. Uh, upside down. There is Barry Larkin. Keep him. Vince Coleman. Will Clark. Bryn Smith. Todd Burns. Jesse Barfield. Bernie Williams. That might be a... I think that's a rookie card. There's another rookie card. Let's move my pile over a bit more. Set him up there like that. Scott Lewis. Willie Wilson. Robin Ventura. Thought that was Mike Mussina for a moment. Doug Drabeck. William Suero. Mark Grace and Dave Martinez. So now we're doing all right. Let's start out here with... Uh, let's keep going with the Bowman. Let's go with uh, 1990. See what I can get from here. There's the gum. Looking pretty good. Let's uh, flip them over. We've got Brian Dubois, Rico Brogna, Rob Nen, Dan Plezak, Willie Banks, Mark Lewis, Propaganda. Oh, that's uh, Kevin Mitchell. Kevin Mitchell card. Um, who else we got here? Cecil Epsi, Claudel Washington, Felix Fermin, Dennis Eckersley. Put him over there in that pile. Another Dave Martinez at the at the back at the end. That's two packs in a row. He showed up like that. All right, where should I go to next? Let's start with uh, 92 Tops baseball. Let's get this a go. I remember opening up hundreds of packs from 92. All right, a little bit tricky. There we go. And what are these? Fold it over like so. Start with Mickey Sasser, John Cerruti, Roger Clemens, rookie, uh, not a rookie card, but a keeper, Dave Justice, not a rookie, Tim Wallach, Mark Lemke, Howard Hojo Johnson, Luis Rivera, Matt Noakes again, all-star card, Steinbeck, Juan Guzman, Bip Roberts, want some more and that's it for that pack so let's go with let's try some series one upper deck what year is this from this is going to be from 92 i think it's going to tell me in a moment when i take a look at the back it's from 1994 1994 don't think i've ever opened these packs up before First card is going to be a Sean Green card. Rookie class. That'll go my Blue Jay pile. And we've got, don't know who Kirk Presley was. Not too many cards in these 94 packs. We've got Benji Gill. Dave McCarty. We have Maddox. Greg Maddox right here. Oh, what is he doing on this photo? It looks like he's stretching or jumping or something. Luis Aquino. Barry Jones. Bobby Jones, rather. Some other players I'm not too familiar with. What do we here, have here on the back? Mike Stanley. Eduardo Perez doing the nice dive there at third base. John Crook. 
And another Roberto Alomar diving from second base. Well, that's pretty cool. Some nice pictures there. Let's get to the 92 upper deck baseball. See what I can get. Start off with a Cincinnati Reds pitcher. Turk Wendell brushing his teeth in the dugout. Bill Swift. Dan Gladden, Lance Blakenship, Gary Sheffield, Willie Randolph, who I saw on the news, uh, was it last week when they were introducing Judge as the uh, next captain of the New York Yankees. They had Don Mattingly, uh, no, Derek Jeter, that Derek Jeter and Willie Randolph there because they were two other captains. Eric Davis, and another Cal Ripken. All right, let's go now to the 1990 Upper Deck. I've got uh, four packs left after this, and then I got my mystery card. Lenny Dykstra, Jeff Hewson, Frank White, Johnny Ray, Chris Carpenter, Buckner, Eddie Williams, Brian Holton, Mark Williamson, Randy McCammon. Just a bunch of commons here. Checklists and Pete in Cavilia. All right, what shall I do with next? Let's uh, finish off the Bowman here, 1989 Bowman. Looking for the looking for Ken Griffey Jr. I know I've got one Hall of Famer. Let's flip this over. We got Ted Williams, John Smiley. I think that's uh, Bud Black. I'm not too sure who that is. Royce Clayton, Paul Kilgus, Tony Fernandez. I've got that card already. And Mike Mussina. Oh, I thought that was Mike Mussina again. It's Brady Anderson. All those Oriole photos are throwing me off. And Tim Raines. All right, let's go with. Uh, I got 387s to go. Let's do tops. Let's do the tops 1987. Looking for Barry Bonds or Greg Maddox. I think Greg Maddox is actually in the tops traded. So it might not be in this pack. All right. No one yet. There's Billy Bean. Of course, he's famous for Moneyball and Oakland Athletics. Bill Swift. We've got the Spring Fever Baseball. Devo White. Jeff Robinson, Nate Snell, and a Reggie Jackson turn back the clock card. All right, let's do the Donruss. And this, we're looking again for the same kind of card. We're looking for Barry Bonds, ideally. John Crook, Dave Steeb, Glenn Wilson, Bryn Smith again, Eric Davis, had a few of those cards already. There's my first Jack Clark, Bill Buckner, Mike Heath, and a puzzle piece. All right, last pack, 87 Fleer. Is it Fleer? Yes, it is. Let's hope for something good. End off on a positive note. Mike Mason, Joe Hesketh, Brooke Jacoby. We've got another Tim Raines, Rance Mullinix, Tony Fernandez, Mike Sosha, Doug Zisk, Doug DeSensei, Ozzy Smith. It's a nice card. Ed Lynch, Eddie Milner, and Juan Samuel.
So we got a couple Hall of Famers in that pile. And now we get to the final. Whatever is in here, my Hall of Famer, let's just carefully open it without damaging. It's always tough how they get them into this uh, packaging and how do you slide it out. They need to be a doctor of some sort. So, our rookie card is going to be, as you can see, Randy Johnson. With the blacked out, uh, that Marlboro sign in the background. So there's our Hall of Famer in his Montreal Expos uniform before he's traded to the Mariners. And our other card is going to be Tony Perez. There's a Tony Perez, uh, authentic fall classic autograph. And it doesn't look to be like a taped on autograph, but actually auto on card from Fleer. You have just received a fall classic autograph card containing the authentic signature from Tony Perez, first baseman for the Cincinnati Reds. That uh, looks to be 2002 Fleer. Well, that's a pretty, pretty sweet card, actually. I think I like that. Never seen these cards before. So, got myself a Hall of Fame auto. I'll put back there. I've got Randy Johnson, rookie card. And I've got Chipper Jones and Bernie Williams. So those are my hits. Hope you enjoyed the video. Let me know what you think. And please like and subscribe. And see you next time.